A game of two halves is a term more often associated with football, but this year it applies just as readily to the Tour de France because the 2014 edition has two distinct characters and it's going to make team selection a real headache. For the first half of the race, it's like a series of classics with tough terrain and crosswinds. But this year, there's some added spice on stage five, which takes in the infamous cobbles of Paris-Roubaix. So to get them to the mountain safely, the star riders will need some big, strong rulers. However, as the race reaches the halfway point, its character changes. The flat roads almost completely disappear, and with them, the big team riders. From the moment they enter the Vosges Mountains on stage eight, there's barely a meter of flat road until they arrive in Paris. The second half of the 101st Tour de France will belong almost exclusively to the small and nimble. So the teams have got to make an agonizing choice. Prioritize getting to the mountains intact or trust the first week to look and plan for the hills. With a team of nine, some squads are gonna try a mix. The danger there is being a jack of all trades and a master of none. With such a variety of challenges and so few kilometers of time trialing, the 2014 race is set to be fascinating from start to finish.